welcome to my first video. Today we're going to be making a Nicaragüense dish called Bigorong. Very easy to make. Um, so these are the ingredients. We have uh, cabbage that I have already cut up, um, diced up tomatoes. Um, for this dish, I have added a little bit of jalapeno. So we're going to try it that way. Um, I think it's going to add a lot of good flavor. Um, we also have pork rinds or chicharrón. I bought them in a bag like this. You can get it at your local grocery store. And I prefer to use frozen yuca or cassava. Um, this is the bag. This is the bag that it comes from. You can find it in your um, freezer aisle at the supermarket. Then the seasonings, I use black pepper, adobo, you can use salt, um, garlic powder. I am gonna use limes. I have a little bit of oregano and then salt and then the pork this is already cooked um i am going to just heat it up and see if i need to adjust the seasonings so the first thing you want to do as this is heating up is taste it to see if you want to add more seasonings it's important to always make sure that you taste your food and i definitely want to add more seasoning so we're going to add a little bit of lemon We're gonna add a little bit of adobo. And again, this is to taste, so I always suggest that you, after you add a little bit, mix it up and then taste your food and see if it needs um, a little bit more. And taste a little bit to see if that's enough. I feel like it can use a little bit more adobo. a little bit of fresh ground pepper. Again, this is to taste, so I like mine with a lot of pepper. A little bit of garlic powder. And a little bit of oregano dried oregano. And make sure that you're breaking down the big pieces so that it's more shredded. In this pot we have enough water to cover the juca. It is salted and has come up to a boil. We will add the juca, let that cook through until it's fork tender, so about 25 minutes or until it's cooked through. So now we are going to make the salad that goes on top of everything. So we have the shredded cabbage. We're gonna put it in a bigger bowl. Diced up tomatoes, again, with a little bit of diced up um, jalapenos, and I have already added the lime. So this is the finished product. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure that you first try the recipe for yourselves. Subscribe, like, share. Um, and now we are going to introduce my cameraman, Rafi. He's gonna be trying it out. He's my taste tester. All right. I'm gonna try to get a little bit of everything. Make sure I get a good taste of it. It's really good. 
Make sure that you check out Rafi's channel to um, content flow. Look him up, subscribe, like, and share. And look out for my next video. We're going to be making meatloaf the next January.